Hello world, my name is Silver Draconis and welcome back to CrossCode. In the last episode, we've been meandering about in the Maroon Valley trying to find our way through things and while the actual way through is quite simple, we just need to walk, uh, I've been trying to find ways to get to puzzly bits and chests and stuff and it's been difficult in that aspect. I haven't been fighting a lot of enemies, admittedly, which I really should be doing. In fact, let's fight these guys. How bad can they be? They're only purple and they have an eye patch. Ooh, they're skittery. They have a skittery. I'm surprised his buddy didn't get aggroed. Ah, I broke you. I broke you. One thing I am sad about, I, I've gotten it running a lot faster than I had before, like when I first started playing, but I am sad that it's still slower for certain. But that, that's nothing but just my computer can't handle it. And eventually I will be getting a new computer, but computers are expensive. So until then, I will have to deal with with a bit slower. And it doesn't even, it, it, it sucks that it's slower. Oh dear, I dropped my controller. Ah, snippy thingies. Come back. Okay, it sucks that it is slower and stuff, but it's not unplayable. Like I can still play it, so that's good. But it just sucks that it the the quality of it is lower, but then I can't have weather effects on either. Because I know there's a place in Autumn Valley where it rains. And I that was one of the first times I found that I had to turn that off because it lagged so bad in that area that I could hardly move. What's the point of this? I can't jump over there. Jump! Okay, I can't. I was just being incompetent. So yeah, it, it sucks also that I have to turn some of those features off. Finding my way to stuff. Can I do this? Is it jump? Can I make that jump? So what is that after that? I'm just fall in the pit. Yeah. Maybe I have to get up top. Probably have to get up top. Then how would I get out of there? I have to get up like that. Logically, I understand that I'd have to make it. Oh wait, no, I don't have to make it. I can just rebound. Ugh. How did I forget? Oh, that's not it. What's my angle? What do I need? Hey, I got it. Okay, so those jump pads are on now. To what end? Also, there's a button. I'm turning stuff on, guys! I'm becoming victorious. That chest has weird stuff on it. Why? So where am I? How do I get to those jump pads? I want to get to those jump pads. How do I get to them? Was I already at them? Probably. I made that. I didn't really want to. For oh, fuck's sake! How do I get back? Out of my way. Okay, here we go. There must have been a reason. Right? Okay. I, I must have to come to it from the other side. And then jump and get up there and then drop down into the tree. Come up from up there. Oh, maybe there's a way over here. There's not a way over here. What am I doing? See this, this, I don't have to do this. I don't, I could just keep moving on, but I can't help it. I need the treasure. I need the loot. I must have it. I needs it. Precious. I'm dead. That's the one I respond on? Fine. Son of a dick. Why can I not break that? Oh, that needs a jumpy pad and then I can get over there. How do I turn that one on? How do you turn on? What's your secret? This one can't be turned on either. There's nowhere I can go for it. Mm. 
I am an irritated person right now. I'm trying to figure out secrety secrets, and I fucking can't. Where am I going? Not this way. Let's go down. Maybe. I don't know where I'm going. That's gonna be me this entire section. It's just, I don't know where I'm going. I don't know what I'm doing. How do I do? Oh no, I don't wanna fight you. I don't wanna fight you. You're annoying and I don't like you. Go away. Go away. Smelly. Don't like it. Don't want none. How do I get up there? Oh, run away. Don't want none. I don't want you to fucking oh, Alright, fine! I didn't want to do this, but you leave me no choice. Come at me, bro. I'm fucking ripped. God. Right, now, don't use fire on this guy. It's very- No, stop using fire! Why do you use fire? It's bad! Don't use fire, Emily. Stop aggroing everything. That would be cool. Wait a minute. Her icon is a croissant, not a sandwich. Ow! I wonder if the food stuffs that you eat is different based on what region you're playing the game from. That would be cool. That would be genuinely really cool. I have to go up to go down. Well, I, I have to get higher up to go south. That sounds better. So here. Could, could you guys push that button for me? I'm guessing I would have to come at it around? I don't know what I'm doing. I've only gotten 5 out of 36 chests. That is ridiculous. Also, I hit the mic. I very much don't apologize. Oh, poo. I don't know what I'm doing or why. Don't get 
I grow to piece of shit and fuck you Tim, I hate you so very much. I keep pushing the wrong button. Can I get down? Get anywhere. <sighs> Maybe I should just move on for now. Please don't aggro, please don't aggro. I don't like you. I don't like the enemies. I don't well, no, that's not true. Some of the enemies are fine, but Tim and those land sharks can fuck right the fuck off. Everything else is fine, but the land sharks where there's like a bunch of them and they all aggro. And then Tim, Mr. I'm resistant to fire, but you have to use fire to break me, but then if you don't kill me in time, I'm gonna spew fireballs at you. Cause fuck you, that's why. Where am I going? So I can't go down. And I can't get down there. And I don't wanna run all the way back to try and go this way. Let's just, let's just get back up there. I'm pretty sure that's where we have to go. I'm pretty- because we're trying to get to Bali Town. Hopefully not too much story will happen when we get to Bali Town. Pardon me. Apologies. Can I get down? Can I get up there? Can I get over there? No, huh. What's that? Rock guys. I, I keep getting distracted because I want to get all the things. I'm just gonna move on. I'm just gonna move on. Grr. Grr. Discipline. Which way am I going? Left. We can explore this area later. Right now, I just want to get to where I'm going get a place that I can teleport in between and have a town and shit that I can go fall back on with new stuff. It'll be good. It'll be good. Oh. Oh. Mon dieu, what a view. No shit. This must be Fiaro Temple, no? It must be. It's fucking gorgeous. Oh. Well... To be honest, I may have overdone it yesterday. But it was so much fun, no? Yeah, but you shouldn't overdo it. If you need to take a break, you can log off. Sometimes it makes you wish you could just stay in this world. I feel you. Hmm. Ah, no, dangerous thinking. Leia, let's not regret- Leia, let's not look like real life like this, the court? Yeah. I'm sure it won't end well. Yeah. Leia, is something the matter? <sighs> no. I know, I tend to talk too much, but you know, if something is bothering me, you can just tell me about it. Well, the problem is, we kinda can't. Just like I did, you see? I feel much better already just by speaking with you. Oh wait, she doesn't know. That's right. She just assumes I don't talk very much, but... Legitimately, she doesn't know. Uh. Well, I won't pressure you, but no, I'm here to listen, okay? That's what friends are for, right? Aww. Aww, look at her face! Yeah. Okay, I got my fill of this view. Let's go on. But I didn't. That's fucking gorgeous! Look at that! That's so cool! Ah. Anyway. Oh, we could teleport here! This is a landmark. But yeah, like, there's no way to tell her, but, like, we literally can't tell her. We have a few words that we can say, and that's it. She doesn't know. Like, the others have figured it out. But she literally doesn't know. So, like, we literally can't. Even if something is bothering us, but something is clearly bothering us, because whenever we go to the, quote-unquote, real world... 
Uh, it's come back here. Whenever we go to the real, come back. Oh, son of a bitch. Trying to talk. Turn you into chicken wings. Come down. Anyway, whenever we go to the real, real world, all we have are like weird dream visions. Like that's it. We don't know what happens when we quote unquote log off. It seems like we just kind of. It, it's never shown us us in the again quote unquote real world because I some, something I don't know something feels off about this game some parts of it feel a bit too and I, I know meta speaking it is all a game but that, that's not what I'm talking about like I'm, I'm talking about like RP wise like in this game that we're playing something about this some parts feel a bit too real if that makes any sense. This guy. Hello. Want to reach our glass building, human? Mm hmm? Easy. Go look for a statue in home village. Bye, Kuma. Village very close. Human just need to go west. Thank you. I don't know why I'm giving them that voice, but it sounds like something like deserty. I don't know. I kinda I kinda gave them like an Argonian voice, I guess, from uh, Skyrim. Or maybe Kaiji, I don't know. Like a Kaiji Argonian type. Looks like we're almost there. Yeah. Cause the Kaiji are from a, a warm, sandy place called Elizwer. They're from a they're they're a desert people. And uh so I, I kind of base my voice around them because they're from a similar place. And Argonians are lizard people. They're from a place called Black Marsh, but they have similar facial structure. Uh, admittedly, they're lizards and these people are birds. But if you look at an Argonian and, and you look at the the, the uh, character pictures of these people, the the facial structure itself is kind of similar, except for the beak. But I guess if you had a beak, you'd probably be lisping a bit like that anyway, so I don't know. Where am I going with this jumping puzzle? Oh, over here. Also, this oasis is really fucking pretty. I just want to point that out there. This is gorgeous, and I love it. I really do love this area, my god. It's so cool. Oh my god, the fern moves when you walk through it. Have I just not noticed? Have I only noticed that now? They move. They move! Look at that! They move! They move. They move. They move. They move. Oh my god, that's fucking cool. Why is that so cool? I don't know, but they move. Unless I found a landmark. Be proud of me, Henry. Oh, this is so pretty. So pretty! I think we reached the village, guys. But yeah, something about this... This feels not quite right. Maybe... I got like half baked theories flowing, flowing through my head. Oh, solar panels! Yeah, that's really smart. I suppose if you live in an area that's like gets a lot of freaking sun, it's really cool. I like that little detail. I keep going off the. God, I want to say something, but I, I keep getting distracted. Anyway, let's let's listen to what they have to say first, and then I'll blab. Here we are. That should be the village. So, how about we go ahead and visit the major building now? You know, to continue the plot and all. Yeah. Like that. Like, late. Not Leia. Emily, for her, it's just a game. We made it. Yeah, that was one hell of an area. Tell me about it. But look at this right here. I was told this was like an urban village for these shot or whatever. Looks like they're pretty advanced after all. I mean, this is a solar farm, right? I think this was built by humans. At least a friend told me there's some kind of relationship going on between humans and Chad. Oh, that makes more sense. I guess. Chad could have built them. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if the Chad did, did build them, because look at all the wires and stuff connecting it all. That is the kind of stuff we've been seeing all around the track. But anyway, I've I, I, I probably been recording for a very long time, so I... Uh, I, I tend to lose track of time in this game, but I'm trying to summarize my thoughts. So, for Emily, 
this is just a game. All this is just a game. Like, she logs off, she comes back on, she, she talks about, you know, how we're just doing it to further the plot and stuff like that. But something about this, and Leia, with Leia especially, it feels more real. So, I don't know if it's the game itself, quote unquote game, the game itself that is actually more real than we think it is, like we're actually on the moon of Shad, like I theorized before, or the new theory that pops in my head, something is with Leia in that she's just an avatar. Like she doesn't have anywhere to go when she logs off. Like, uh, uh, what's his name? It's been a while since I've heard from him, I don't even remember his fucking name anymore. What the fuck is his name? What's his name? What's his name? Sergey! Sergey! Like, Sergey and Carla and everything, they, they log off and like, they... Yeah, he found us in the cargo hold and that we lost our memory or whatever and we're trying to give it back, but like, what if... What if Leia's something else? What if Leia was either a... Well, no, I don't think Leia was creative, but what if Leia is something else? I don't know. Something different. I'm not saying she's AI, because that doesn't seem to be, because there is still that thing we saw in the very beginning, and I firmly believe that that is Leia. It has the same scar and, like, the same eyes. Like, I firmly believe that that person in the beginning was Leia, and that the blue avatar dude was maybe our brother? I don't know who the blue avatar dude is yet in relationship, but... I'm certain that our brother is not as dead as we think he is. Or that somebody else will come into play due to all that. But, something is with Leia. Some, some, something. Like, how could she have been playing it that long ago? Maybe this, all this is real to an extent. And she was walking the path of the ancients a long ass time ago. Because back in the in the intro sequence as well, that seemed real. It didn't seem like it was a game. Because her brother was like coding the coding something or doing something for these people or whatever, and it felt very real. It's like, what the fuck is going on? Oh, I want to know. I want to know so bad. I want to know so bad. Ugh. But yeah, okay, that is gonna do it for this episode. Then in the next episode, we'll be exploring the town of Shad. Is it called? No, that's not the name! Shit with names. What the hell is the name? Baiku! Baiku! I didn't even need to look it up. I remembered it. Baiku. So we'll be exploring the town of Baiku and we'll see what everything has to offer. And we'll look for like the training post, the item shop, everything like that. I'm certain we can complete a quest as well. Maybe. We can finally beat this one. No, it's only more winter forms. I might go back. I might go back and do that off cam. Uh, we also have enough for this, so we can go... Actually, we'll probably do this one next episode, Heating the Hermit, and then we'll just work on getting more air lumber for that, because I gotta get more winter thorns anyway. And it's not like I'm not gonna be getting air lumber. It's not as hard to get as the winter thorns are. So, that is the plan for next episode, but until then, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, let me know. If you didn't, let me know. If you got any tips or tricks or anything you want to see me do, comment down below, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye!